Hello and welcome to another DVD update from Movie Reviews 101. I am Darren and today I am going to be looking at a couple of E! movies. First up is going to be a film I have actually only bought just to watch for my Emma Stone weekend, Easy A. I've yet to see it, I've only ever heard good things about it, but that genre never really interested me too much, but now I'm going to give that one a go. So if it is good, let me know and I'll try and give it a good review. Next up, we go to one of my favourite directors, Mr John Carpenter. I've got both Escape from New York and Escape from LA. And I know that LA has bad CGI, and so what? They were fun. They're just fun action movies. Kurt Russell kicks ass. You just have nonsense going on, and it's just entertaining. And it shows just how good John Carpenter could be with a low budget. Anyway, up next, another guilty pleasure, I would say, this one would be The Eight-Legged Freaks with David R. Kett and the very young Scarlett Johansson. This film is just fun. The kills are mental, the spiders are mental, everything is just over the top. Paying homage to everything you've ever seen in those type of films. It is seriously just one to sit back and enjoy. Anyway, next up, I went with one that didn't get the reviews it probably could have deserved, but was difficult to follow up District 9 with Elysium. And Elysium was a very interesting sci-fi movie about the healthy people living on a spaceship and the ill or normal people with no chance of survival living on Earth. It plays out how you would expect, but has a few mecha monster cr or machine creations involved. But it is well worth a watch if you do like your sci-fi. It might not be brilliant, but it is entertaining at the best of times. And where would we be without another one of an Arnold Schwarzenegger over-the-top action movies, End of Days, one of his only attempts at doing something remotely horror, and it's him versus the devil before the devil sacrifices a young lady. Yeah, it sounds pretty bad, but it was Arnie. You always watch an Arnie movie. You're only going to watch them because it's him. They're just action-filled and fun. It's one of the best of later career before his rebooted career as such. But anyway, that, that'll complete the E selection today. Is there any more film titles beginning with E that I should have in my collection? Leave a comment in the box below. And remember to like the video. Follow us on Twitter. Like us on Facebook and visit the website for more reviews. Again, thank you, this has been Darren, and we we'll hope to see you for the next video.